Morning everyone, how are you? Long time no see on YouTube. Um, just to let you know, things are going great. Um, getting colder, got my winter leathers on, my bald head is covered up by my flat cat and I've got my big winter beard. Um, so yeah, all good. Lots of positive things have been happening and um, well, it's not that long till Christmas, so really, my main job is closing a few deals uh, before Christmas. Um, and then um, our pipeline is almost complete for 2019. Uh, so we're seeing one client today uh, in Fulham, and um, it's literally just to finish off uh, a few points, crossing the T's and dotting the I's. Um, and that is for a full refurb on a terraced house in Fulham. Uh, and then uh, a small one in Wimbledon, uh, hopefully doing the same this week. And what else? What else? What else? What else? Oh, something really cool. So, um, what we have been working on is a brilliant uh, site in Wimbledon. Uh, and it's to build two really modern and contemporary houses. One is six and a half thousand square feet. The other is four and a half thousand square feet. Uh, really cool basements, swimming pools, spas, jacuzzis, and all that kind of stuff. Beautiful. Um, so um, what I'm trying to do, I'm bringing in one of my good friends who is a uh, new build house builder. So he's coming along and he's going to be sort of JVing with me on this one because it is quite a complex project and uh, basically I want to bring him on to do the shell, core and structure and we will do the fit out and the design. Uh, so this is going to be really brilliant and uh, looking forward to this one. So it's got planning ready to go and yeah it's just oven ready. Um, so it's all a question about numbers, uh, getting it to stack up for the client and uh, making sure there's a good profit margin in there for NU. Uh, so that's that in Wimbledon and also we've got that little one in Norwood still, uh, still bubbling away. Client is still a little bit indecisive. Uh, we've given them our, our build estimate and uh, I think it's coming in at 1.1 million so what we're doing we're just getting that firmed up with a quantity surveyor to make sure it stacks up uh, correctly and um, that will be shown to the client and that will give them the confidence hopefully to sign with uh, NU projects um, sometime in January so that's that um, what else well, basically, uh, we've had quite a few new inquiries. The week before last, we had three basement inquiries in Fulham. One was in Cloncurry Street. That is literally um, 10 minutes up the road from my office. So um, basically, we've done one before in Cloncurry. And that one we did before, it was a complete new build, but what we did, we kept the facade. So the front of the building we kept, and we demolished all the rest of the property. So doing it like that, the client can save VAT. So they can save 20% VAT by demolishing the rear of the property. And by demolishing the rear of the property, you can maximize the square footage and you can sort of create a new build property where everything is as you want. Um, so it's a little bit ex more expensive, but again, you're saving the 20% on the VAT. So the, the guy who phoned up, his name's Nick too, he was very pleased I've come out of this new idea. So um, it's quite, um, it's quite a dramatic idea really because it's a terraced house and we are going to be keeping the facade and demolishing the rear so let's see if we can get them in to um, see our architect so we can draft up some concept design sketches uh, and that was that and there was another one uh, 
uh, in the Alphabet Streets in Fulham, and this one was in Lycia. And um, the guy again, he wants uh, a full basement, no planning. Uh, so we need to get our architect round there to sit down with him to draft up some concept design uh, sketches and give him a rough idea on the build cost, which I already have. And this basement, the house is really wide. For, so for a terraced house, it's really wide and very deep. This basement, I reckon, is gonna be 1,100 square feet. So it's a big basement for Fulham. And um, the guy wants the staircase going down into the basement from the kitchen. So it's gonna be really open plan kitchen, st glass staircase going down into the basement. So when it goes down into the basement, it's gonna be coming out in the middle of the basement, which is gonna split the front of the basement up, so which is gonna be quite nice. So you can have at the front um, bedroom ensuite utility, and then in the middle you can have maybe your cinema room, games room, whatever you want. And maybe at the back you can have again another bedroom ensuite and um, access to the uh, uh, garden from the basement that way as well. So yeah, lots going on and um, just normal little jobs. Lots of uh, uh, refurb, side returns, we're pricing. So I think at the moment in my sort of uh, pipeline, I think we've got about 20 projects we're pricing up and um, five we should be signing before Christmas because we do, as we're getting busy now, we've got up to a six to eight month um, waiting time to have have a start of the project. So we've got a lot of, um, lot of projects in the pipeline. We need to keep everyone happy. And uh, so we're giving everyone uh, start dates, you know, for, June, July next year, and um, yeah, it's all looking good, very exciting. So anyway, what have you lot been up to? Um, is there anything you need to know about us? Would you like to know more about basement construction? Why build a basement? Well, the reason by why I'd build a basement, you're gonna create more square footage. That entails gonna add more value to your property and you're gonna create more space for your family. So, um, let me know and um, I will get back to you um, sometime next week because at the moment it is quite busy and um, literally I'm just on the way to see a, a, a client now um, in Fulham. So yeah, literally have a great day. Good to catch up with you again and um, I will speak to you soon. See ya.